And here's a little uh, guangxiensis. So I just put the tail in and I just kind of wait. Sometimes I spit it out. Um, if they're real resistant to finishing on their own, I'll force it down all the way. Um, but I like, as time has gone on, um, I prefer to just kind of start it and let them do the rest. I think that's a healthier approach than just pushing it all the way down. It gets them more accustomed to eating on their own. Um, and they seem like they switch over to, uh, to meals on their own more readily this way. So you can see it's starting to kind of edge forward and, uh, and go for the prey. So I'm going to video for another few seconds and then I'm going to shut it down just to, uh, to let it have some privacy and finish eating. But you can see Guangxian's sister incredible. They're, at least to me, uh, remarkably similar to Cynodon in a lot of ways, but uh, they're smaller. Um, they have big, bright red eyes, which is awesome. And, uh, I don't know, they're just uh, a really unique boy.